I'm just going to run over some of my solar projects which are to all extents and purposes in limbo at the moment because uh, uh, people have a pathological uh, fear of new stuff. Anyway, the only person working on this one is, uh, this is the tracking solar accumulator, it seems to be David Williams and um, he calculated um, the size of dish needed for um, um, a parabolic dish to be balanced uh, with its center of gravity on its focus and uh <coughs> um, anyway this is uh, pretty much a new idea of um, I can't get people to look at it like they're I don't know what's wrong with them anyway people are not looking at this but this is potentially a very easy way of um, this could work uh, so um, sterling engine or uh, solar cooking or accumulating uh, heat and I have a, a new uh, tracker idea for it too I'm just going to pop over to tracking so we're on another um, page on the solar cooking wiki now this is the tracking wiki so someone put this I don't believe I put this in here someone else did I'm pretty sure anyway here's a new thing from students at Berkeley now their problem is their um, uh, liquid that they're tracking um, their container moves and no one seems to everyone seems to be okay with that except that uh, it would cause a lot of trouble uh, <coughs> over the course of the day because uh, stuff is going to um, spill over anyway in in my uh, design the containers don't move you can have one here one here and there's other ways of doing this too where maybe um, I think you're going to end up uh, we have to have the two um, paraboloids anyway we're going this is one of my little things uh, on equatorial mount the big deal is to have a slow rotation and um, this is one of my ideas for low tech versions of that but you could just do it with um, a tracker for a telescope should work just fine but the solar cooking people don't want to look at it, it's too scary for them. They want, um, here's another tracking thing I had an idea for. This is another one a guy called Mike Murphy did graphics for me because I'm useless at graphics. Anyway, we'll run away from the tracking page to clamps shaped solar. This is another project that uh, I think David Williams did a little work on this too. He has an idea for a ripple mirror which I don't understand but um, uh, once some pictures goes in I think it will um, make a big difference anyway this is I'll come down here this is a science based thing I have uh, a way of modeling the sun's movement so that you can design a solar cooker for unattended use that will give you basically full power for two hours and I've made one and I didn't make it very well I, I never make any of these things very well because uh, I, I have some gifts but I don't have everything anyway here we come down explanations of what's going on etc etc here's my first um, start of my first model and I let's see here what do we have Oh yeah, we get to uh, cooked potatoes on it. I'm going to try something here as well. Slam shaped. Mm, this one here. I don't know if this is going to show. This is the whole deal. This is a PDF I made. So I made this. Then I made my model. I made the full model out. I uh, made uh, a little template in this. A little small one. And I scaled it up in a big uh, this big thing here glued it all together stuck it all together and it came it became this big shovel thing and I cooked potatoes in it and I think I moved uh, it was really 
Um, it was a nice day in February, but the uh, sun was really low in the sky. Anyway, I cooked my potatoes with one move of my um, this thing. Um, uh, I think it took about three hours, but um, I didn't have it set up properly or anything. I didn't, this needs ribs. And anyway, I'm just going to go to the other one. Um, my tracking accumulator PDF. Uh, so these are just some of the things I've done over the, f the years that haven't been looked into at all. So this mechanical mathematician. No one has, um, you know, with all the sustainability stuff that goes on, no one has, no one has made this. Uh, here's the first one I made. I made um, a parabolic dish with it and, and um, cooked some stuff in it. This is uh, <coughs> an off-center paraboloid, which is... Uh, um, useful. Uh, this is uh, off-center paraboloid made on this dish up here that I used for my first accumulator, just uh, my first trial run of it. And it seems I'm one of two or three people in the world that have done this on our own. And here's my... Um, this was the solution to the center of gravity moving problem that I had, is two dishes. One goes up, one goes down, and um, and this is the um, the new tracker idea. And I just don't have the skills to do this, um, um, but um, someone does. Uh, what else we're going to do? Uh, one more thing to show you. It is this one here. Okay, this guy, Rimar2000, he has made something similar and he has a counterweight in front of it. And um, he has to adjust the mirrors occasionally. But maybe something, uh, this is, has potential too, like the counterweight in front idea. And uh, his pot is on the rotating axis. I think this is the axis that he rotates on. Um, but I think what's going to work uh, well we'll wait and see but if people don't try it nothing's going to work uh, I think uh, my design a combination of this and my design might um, uh, work for solar cooking with the pot in on the, the axis of rotation anyway uh, what else is going to do um, well, I was going to leave it at that, I think. People, this is um, the two things: the tracking accumulator with the two, um, the two dishes, two half dishes, and the um, clamshaped solar. Um, nobody has done this uh, except me on model scale. And I'm not sure what's going on. Like, uh, have people switched off their their thinking brains? Uh, they refuse to look at this uh, because people do puzzles online and stuff like that, and do murder mysteries and stuff like that. But um, uh, this is not beyond uh, the brain power of anyone. Like, um, ordinary people can figure this out. You have to look at it a little but you can figure it out and maybe have an input into it. Anyway I'm going to stop it there and hopefully we'll get uh, some people going on this and we'll get it uh, over and done with because I'm fed up with it to be quite fun.